have you ever connected an aluminum cable to a copper bus bar? Go back to that connection in a few years and you will likely find corrosion. This corrosion interferes with your solar panel's electrical connections, reducing the power output and basically costing you money. This small product or a biometallic lump, which has copper and aluminum sections, helps prevent this kind of damage and keeps your solar panels lasting long. Let's explore how this small product works. Hey everyone, my name is Sahil and in today's video, we will discuss bimetallic lugs. In this video, you will understand what is a bimetallic lug, its applications in solar excavations, and how it fights corrosion. But why should you listen to me? At Axis, we have been manufacturing a wide range of lugs and connectors, including bimetallic lugs, for the past 30 years. We will find our lugs installed in solar plants, utility scale applications, substations, transformers, control panels, switchgears, and many more applications across the world. Let's start by understanding the basics. A cable lug is a component used to connect an electrical wire or cable to an electrical component equipment or as a termination point. Cable lugs are designed to create a secure, mechanically strong and electrically conductive connection between the conductor and the component it is being connected to. Lugs are used in situations where a strong and long-lasting electrical connection is necessary, but directly connecting the conductor to the equipment is just not practical. This could be due to limited space, different conductor sizes or types or many other reasons. Lugs available in the market are primarily copper, like this one, but you'll also find aluminium and bimetal. Before understanding the lugs in detail, make sure you are informed about how to even install lugs properly, the different applications of lugs and general updates. Subscribe to our beefing newsnet. You will find the link in the comments. Now, let's understand bimetallic lugs in detail. When two different metals are in contact for a long period of time, they can cause dissimilar metal corrosion or galvanic action. This happens, for example, when a copper lug connects to an aluminum cable. Here, both are different metals with distinct electrochemical properties, therefore, an electrochemical driving force exists between them. Hence, galvanic action occurs. Galvanic action or corrosion is simply when one metal corrodes preferentially when it is an electrical contact with another metal in the presence of an electrolyte. In the case of copper and aluminium, aluminium acts as a sacrificial anode and becomes susceptible to corrosion. But bimetallic lugs solve this issue by preventing contact. They are made by welding a copper palm to an aluminium barrel. This way, aluminium conductors connect with the aluminium barrel and the copper bus bar connects with the copper palm. To stop oxidation, the inside of the lug barrel is coated with an oxide inhibiting compound. This enhances the contact quality and ensures a smooth electrical connection. But why do these bimetallic lugs themselves don't develop dissimilar metal corrosion right here? You might be thinking, there are also two distinct electrochemical properties that are now coming in contact. How are they safe? The answer to this question is simply friction welding. Here, you join the two metallic surfaces by generating heat through friction. The parts being joined are held under high compressive loads. This leads to the diffusion of atoms across the surface, resulting in a metallurgical bond between the materials. This bond eliminates dissimilar metal corrosion. Before moving on, if you want to constantly evolve your knowledge of electrical engineering, please like this video and subscribe to our channel for more videos on electrical engineer. Finally, the need and application of bimetallic lugs in solar plants. Solar panels are installed in open environments where rain, humidity, big temperature changes, and salty air can cause problems. The moisture content starts electrochemical reactions that can lead to corrosion. This is where bimetallic lugs come into the picture. Power systems usually use aluminum cables because they're economical and light. But when we connect an aluminum cable to a copper bus bar, this causes different metals to come into contact. This will lead to galvanic corrosion. Bimetallic lugs are the solution. Similarly, Bimetallic strips play an important role in solar packing. Throughout the day, the sun changes direction and the solar panels need to adjust their angle accordingly. Bimetallic strips sense temperature changes and accordingly change the solar panel's direction. 
These strips work on the principle of distant thermal expansion coefficients of two dissimilar metals bonded together. In simple words, the bimetallic strip consists of two thin strips of different metals, for example steel and copper or steel and brass, bonded together along their nets. These metals have different coefficients of thermal expansion, which means they expand or contract at different rates when subjected to temperature changes. As a result, with the bimetallic strip, solar tracking becomes automatic, increasing the efficiency of solar energy use and reducing energy worse. At Axis, our team of 50 plus engineers is ready to support your next solar project with Z connectors, early and lacking connection systems, and much more. Before moving on to another video and making a wrong decision on lug selection, watch this video to learn the different types of lugs and their applications in detail.